Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I am back with another plan with me and for this week I am going to be planning for the week of April 20th up until the 26th which is this past week. As you guys know I love to memory plan in my cloud planner. This is an Oristel cloud planner for those of you guys who don't know and I am using her vertical inserts as well. I've been using these inserts for about a month now and I really have liked them. Um, it's definitely been a different planning style than I've ever tried before and um, I don't know I just really like to try out different systems. I was debating whether I wanted to film a video like a mock spread in my new 2020 through 2021 life planner which I just made a whole review video of so make sure you go check that out. Those go up I believe tomorrow the 27th for EC Insiders and the 29th for the general public. So make sure you check that out. They have made quite a bit of changes from last year's planners and I'm really excited. And if I, I feel like I've said it before in a plan with me, but I am going to be going back to a life planner for the new academic year, which starts in July. But for now, let's go ahead and embrace the kits that I can use in this layout probably all over the place because I just got a call from my sister but for this week I'm going to be using a Sadie sticker kit and this artwork I actually used for my washi kits for April if you guys noticed the little butterflies. I didn't purchase this full price. I actually got it in one of her um, sticker grab bags back in I believe Black Friday so definitely pick some grab bags up whenever she has them. I don't think I paid that much money for this. This kit is called a lavender and it has a bunch of just pretty um, mint and purple colors, a lot of lavender, of course, and I love that it's foiled with silver foil because that's one of the foils that I don't typically use that often, although I do think I used it for Easter, so I'm glad that I'm using more of that. So my little grab bag, I got the um, bow headers, this is a full boxes page. This has a lot of pastel colors, which I think is perfect for spring. This is all of your boxes, appointment labels, and things for your sidebar. You have some today and to-do headers, some more extra like little washi strips, some checklists. I love to use those. Some icons, and last but not least, the bottom washi page, which I love. I absolutely love these butterflies in here with some day covers. So that is what I'm going to be using for today. And as for my washi, I pulled out one of my cute pastel purple simply gilded washi with white polka dots and it has a silver foil which works out perfectly. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to lay down my date covers, my full boxes, bottom washi, and I will be right back to start with the sidebar with you guys. Okay, so I'm all done with my full boxes. Those look pretty nice. I think most of these are really similar to what they have or the things that they have. So I just thought that they would look good anywhere. Okay, so let me start with my sidebar. I think I found the perfect way so that everything aligns um, with this all. So I'm not going to be using this full box right here. I really like this one for reasons that you guys probably already know. So I'm going to put the full box up here and then let's do let's actually do all of these headers first so I never know how to do this so I have to look at this one so this one will go all the way down here I believe so let's do these um this week was my mom's birthday week and of course we spent it at home we had a little quarantine birthday party celebration, just um, me, my parents, and my little brother. I 
and I'm glad that I'm doing the headers this way now because I don't know if you guys saw last week's plan with me. That was kind of a mess, wasn't it? Just, just a little bit. Okay, so this one here. And then a pink one here. Oh, I just realized that last time before I started with my sidebar, I laid down my checklist. So I think I'm going to do that. So this kit does have checklists and I am just going to trim them to threes because I don't need that many. Aside from it being my mom's birthday, it was also my friend Claudia's birthday on the 22nd. It's cute because her birthday lands on Earth Day and she loves that. <laughs> so what I like to do with my checklist is I'll put some on top and then I'll kind of switch off between the top and the bottom. So I'm going to do bottom for Tuesday and then let's do some of my headers right there usually on the other days if I don't have a checklist down here I'll forget my header but hopefully I don't this time around okay so that's this and then let's do a bottom one I was thinking too when, when laying down my bottom washi that I could have totally just gone with nothing um, but what was in the kit. But then I thought to myself, I really like this um, Simply Yielded washi and it, there's not always a time where I can use them, especially this color. So I thought that I would just match it with this kit. And I was really debating whether I wanted to have the butterflies here or this one. But ultimately, I went with the butterflies because I like that. I just like how good um, the butterfly foil looked. So that's what happened down there. Okay, we're almost done here. Let's do some peachy, peachy header now. I'm hoping to get this video up earlier than I've been getting these up. Um, definitely up on Sunday, but I have a live stream today on my Patreon at 6. So definitely want to get this video up before that, hopefully. Okay, so now that I have that there, I'm going to lay down my habit trackers. And the way that I did this last time so that it matched up perfectly is I went ahead and put my first habit tracker down and then I put some so let me do this one right here and I've been leaving just a little bit of space between everything and that seems to have worked out in the past like two weeks I think okay so I'll put that there and then let me do oops do I want to do this one Let's do this one and this is going to be for my ombre box and then let's do, ooh, do I, I actually don't like how there's so much purple down here so let me switch it actually let's see if I can do this this paper, I, I can't say nothing but good things about this Oristel paper. None of my stickers peel it up, which is kind of crazy. And I will keep talking about that because it's pretty amazing to me. Okay, so put that there. And then what do I put down here? I guess I can put another one of these right here. Yeah, that works. Okay. One here, and that goes down pretty well. And that kind of matches with that box. Ooh, perfect. Okay, so we have another perfect cider bar, and I say perfect like that because nothing is perfect, but okay, it looks great. So now that I have everything done and that looks great, let's start with day by day. So on Monday it was my mom's birthday, so I do want to mark that. I'm going to take see how many half boxes I have. Oh, okay, I have quite a few. 
let me do this one. And that's going to be tomorrow because my mom's birthday. I also went ahead and got my plan with me up this day. But I think somebody gave me an idea last time to, instead of putting my videos every single day, that I could just put them in um, my weekly box, which that is totally something that I'm going to try out this week. For this week, I think. Just because I don't have that much space to put much. So let's see. On Monday, I got up my plan with me. On Tuesday, I believe I got up my week three check-in. Yes, so week three check-in. On Wednesday, I got up the new Erin Condren Life Planner. So let's put... didn't get it up anything on Thursday or Friday but yesterday I did a planner throwback tag so make sure you check that out if you guys haven't so let's put the planner TBT and then today I plan on getting up my plan with me so five videos this week, so not too bad. I actually like having my videos there, I like that. I just like to symbolize it, you know, with um, cute little icons. I'm going to, off the bat now, get all of my silver stickers. I like to keep them in this Erin um, Condren accordion pouch and kind of divide all of my foils by the foiled color. So let's see, I have quite a few as you guys can see. Okay, let me put that on the side and and for my mom's birthday, there's not really an icon here. So let me get a munchkin. Let me do one of these birthday munchkins. I will do this one. And I'll put mom's birthday. I'm glad that, um, you know, I still live at home because I was able to really celebrate with my mom. So I'll put mom's birthday here. So for my mom's birthday, we celebrated in a couple of ways. We got some norms for breakfast. We had boiling crab for lunch. Oh, I definitely want to mark that. And then at night, to finish off with her birthday, my mom helped me out with packing orders. So let's do one of these meal icons to write down. I'm not going to put that we had norms, but I do want to put that we had boiling crab, which is Cajun shrimp. Oh, if you guys have never had Cajun shrimp, you guys need to have some because that was amazing. That's like one of my grandpa's favorite things to eat when um, when he comes here. And my dad was able to pick it up on his way home. So let's put boiling crab. After boiling crab, I do want to put that I worked on orders. So let's see which one do I want to use. These icons are from Crabs by Tally. And I think I'm going to do this one and maybe I'll use like a fancy label or something this one right here at first I was looking at these labels and I was like maybe I could use that for um for my videos but since I'm not marking my videos anymore I guess I can put that. Well, I guess I can mark like my me filming and editing the video. So let's do orders here. Um, and then I can put film and upload, I guess. Let me not forget my header this time. So let me do my header. And then I'll just put like a filming editing script. I know I have that somewhere. So I have some, let's see, I have some film edit scripts. So let's do upload because I didn't film it this day. The plan with me, I actually filmed the day prior. 
to use some of these icons since we're already here, you know? Mm, or is that too much foil? I've been going crazy with the foil just because I've, I have some pieces here, but I think maybe we should put like a decorative sticker. Okay, I'm going to use this little redhead with her laptop and coffee from Fox and Pip. So, and the upload. That looks great. Okay, I love that. So that's going to be it for Monday. On Tuesday, I replied back to messages. So for messages, let me get this pink quarter box and I'll take one of these and I'll write down reply to messages. That's cute. I don't know if I should zoom in just a tiny bit. Let me know if you guys like to be like zoomed in this much or um, if you guys want me to zoom out. I don't think people mind when I get this zoomed in, but let me know. So I will put messages. So after messages, I had a one-on-one -on -one with one of my patrons, Taylor. Maybe we'll do a quarter, like an appointment label for that. Yeah, so I think I'll do this appointment label. find like a little laptop honestly i've been having my one-on-ones on my phone anyways but um i am just going to use these laptops and these are the really tiny happy mini sheets if you guys are wondering from fox and pip so let's put one on one so i had my one-on-one -on -one with taylor morning at 10 a.m so i'm gonna put that and then after that I have quite a bit of things to put. I want to put that I filmed videos because I did film my life planner launch video, which took me a little bit. If you guys watched that video, I believe the footage in the beginning was like an hour to film, but um, I then later brought it down to 39 minutes. So definitely want to mark that. Ooh, and I actually have some scripts here that I could use. I don't have film, but that's fine. Okay, let's see. So I have these from Whimsical Cat Studio, and I don't know what it is, but I want to kind of cut off my little script that says film so that I could use my own. I'm probably doing too much right now, I know, guys. So this little girl here, which she's like perfect for like filming any type of like planning videos. And I'm going to put the film script up right there. That looks... That just looks so cute. Okay, love that. I also cut vinyl this day, but I think I'm just gonna put it in my checklist. I had a Bible study, but I think Bible study I'm gonna put as a habit tracker. I had Chick-fil-A. And I uploaded a post on Instagram, which go ahead and follow me on Instagram, guys, at Romina Plans. I am so pumped because I want to start posting a lot on there. And I feel like I just wasn't super motivated to do so. But now I definitely am because I have, of course, brand new things from Erin Condren that I want to share with you guys as well as I've been taking pictures here and, um, here and there from like my academic planner and stuff like that. So let's do, let's do my Instagram post. And I should have probably, I'm not going to pull it up right now, but because I want to do, so I had Chick-fil-A this day. Ooh, my mom made pork chops. Oh my god, guys. It's so funny because I just got my mom into planning. I gave her a softbound planner that I was meaning to give to my uh, one of my old professors, but I never got a chance to see her, so I just gave it to her, and I've kind of been um, making her plan out her day, and she really likes it, actually, so it's funny to see. And the main reason I did that was because I wanted her to keep track of like the things that she's cooking and to also help me out whenever I film these videos. So yeah, that's how Tuesday is going to look. And then moving on to Wednesday the 22nd. On Wednesday, that was my friend Claudia's birthday. So I think I'm gonna get another one of these decorative half boxes. This one, or I think I want to do this white one actually. Okay, 
so let's do this to mark Claudia's birthday and in the past I've been really bad actually with kind of staying in touch with my friends so I don't know if you guys follow me on Instagram once again but I posted my tending list from my power sheets and one of my weekly actions that I want to start doing is kind of reaching out to a friend um, so of course I wanted to reach out to her prior to her being her birthday but that's kind of how things turned out and we had a we had a pretty good talk so let me get another one of these birthday munchkins and I will put Claudia's birthday it was funny because when it was my birthday um she was so pumped because it's supposed to be our Kobe year and so I was like I'm so sorry that your Kobe year started in quarantine but yeah so that's gonna be for that Aside from that, I have other things that I did, like cut vinyl, work on orders. One thing that I do want to mention is that in order to get my life planner um, video up or really early on Wednesday, I had to stay up on Tuesday until like 3 in the morning to make sure that I was done editing it. It was already uploaded, which takes forever. And also I have like everything ready for like the giveaway that I'm running on there. So if you guys are interested in winning $75 credit from the Erin Condren site, make sure to check out that video i'm going to put first that i was so tired because i honestly was almost like a robot on like auto mode just working so i did cut a lot of stickers put one of low battery munchkins but first let me do my food so this day we ate spaghetti so let's put you right here Put a recharge kind of munchkin and then we'll do orders. This quarter box for orders. First. Um, I have to do a header. Ooh, I'm actually not forgetting about my headers. Who am I? So put my header here. I think there's like extra. So I'll put my header there. And then what else did I say I was going to put? Orders. So then I'll use the other icons I have here. Oh, okay. So let's do orders right here. And then the low battery munchkin. Okay, so I had spaghetti like I mentioned. And I'll put I literally was like a walking zombie, but I was still getting my things done, which is funny. So that's gonna be pretty much it for the first half of the week. Love all the purple. And then moving on to Thursday. Also, I just realized that I misspelled spaghetti, but do I feel like going back? No, I don't. I'm sorry, guys. Okay. <laughs> so for Thursday, I had two one-on-ones pretty much back-to-back. -back. Well, I had a one-on-one -on -one at 8 a.m., which, oh, guys, I was so tired the day before that I was a little, a little late for my one-on-one, -on -one, but Brianna definitely was super, super understanding. So I had two one-on-ones, and then I had a work meeting in between it those two so let's see for my one on ones I use laptops so I'm thinking we can do these let's see these like decorative appointment labels oops And I'll put like a work meeting in between. That's what I'm thinking. I haven't mentioned this yet, but I actually didn't stream on Twitch this week because I was pretty much all over the place. And 
really, really busy with not only the you know Erin Condren stuff, but um, with orders. You guys have shown me so much support, and I always say this. I feel like in every single video because I feel like I have your unconditional support, which is so crazy um, to even say right now. So let's do my work meeting right here, and then my other one on one. So I had a one on one with Brianna and Karina. Okay, and then a work meeting. and for the work meetings I have been getting on FaceTime with my sister to kind of talk about what she's going to be doing for the day she has been taking over on orders and although you know nobody's perfect she's doing such an amazing job and I'm so so thankful to her because I feel like without her I'd be super stressed out and I probably wouldn't even be able to make videos for you guys so super super thankful for her I always put work meetings instead of it just being meetings, so I guess I can just go back and wipe that out, and I might just well just go back and wipe that spaghetti up too. Okay, I also want to put on here that I studied because I haven't marked that in any of the other days. I also uploaded a post on Patreon, but I'll put that here. I had USPS pickup on Thursday. Let's do like a half box for studying and that should be it for that. Yeah, so let's do this one. That works. So I'll put the half box here and then we'll put study day. I believe I have a script for that. Yes, I do. Okay. So let me get some like study. I know I have like some Fox and Pip girls here. Let's see. Yes, I have these. I used these last week, I think, for the first time. So let's do this one here. And then my study day script. All up in the books. That works. I think that's okay. All right. So that's going to conclude Thursday. And now moving on to Friday. On Friday, I had another work meeting in the morning. So I am going to mark it. But first, let me mark that I replied back to messages. So let's do, let's do one of these labels. It's decorative labels. And I'll take some of these envelopes, messages for customer service messages, um, aside from that, we'll put my work meeting in it. and then I also want to put that this day, my boyfriend's little sisters Melanie and Karen actually came over my house to help me out with orders. It was her first time working with me and it was both of them which was which is quite a lot because typically I only have one person helping me out and my room is really tiny so we definitely had to adjust and I had Karen organizing stickers and then I had Melanie cutting on two of my silhouettes which guys my cameos have been giving me so much trouble the past couple of months I would say and I know what the problem is it's just that I can't get it fixed right now so I have bought new machines for the time being um, and smaller ones I actually just posted a picture on Instagram which speaking of Instagram I did post um, a picture on Friday so let's do this doesn't do okay I want to do a half box for the girls coming over to help me so I think I'll do this purple one right here. And then I guess I can do IG post. I'm trying to decide if I want to do my header up here or down here. I almost want to do it up there. 
What's after pink? Okay, so I think it's this one. Now. I don't think that's straight. <laughs> I'm usually not bothered much, but, you know, sometimes I am. Sometimes it bothers me when it's not straight. Will I have to? space to put my Instagram post. Stay tuned. Okay, let's do Instagram post right here. I don't even think I'm going to have time to put. Oh, I went to La Monarca, which I hadn't gone in a while. It's okay. We'll just put it somewhere in my checklist. Although I really love like decorative planning with um, my full boxes, I do miss the space that I had in my hourly because I would just put things that I would do every single hour mm, okay so for helping out with orders I'm going to use these from one ton in a million I haven't used these in a while they're the sticker shop sheet and I guess I'll put her here okay so I'll put Karen and Melanie orders like that and then I do post day perfect okay so that's gonna be it for friday oh i love how this bread looks um moving on to saturday on saturday morning i had um, a usps pickup for my orders so i woke up pretty early in the day before the mailman came over to pick them up and pack them so what i'm going to do i almost want to do like one of these ombre boxes i think i am so I'm going to put that I packed orders with mom. I also cut vinyl so I can put that there. And then I had a USPS pickup. So maybe we'll do pack orders. I'll do USPS pickup. And So we have those. I also had a class. So let me do some sort of quarter box. I kind of want to do this one. This fancy label. What do I want to put up for class? Ooh, we had Hawaiian barbecue. Oh, and I didn't put what I ate on Friday, but I ate chuclito saltado. Oh, so good. Okay, I am going to put... Hawaiian barbecue here. I'll put class and then at night I started cutting stickers in my portrait. So let's do Hawaiian. Barbecue. We'll do Class. For class, I'm going to use these cute stickers. They're like online learning ones from Whimsical Cat Studio. So maybe I'll put it here since I have more space. And then I'll put cutting there. Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. So let's do some print and cut here and then class I'll do right there. I might just end up doing the school little script since I have that here. Maybe I'll put like online school because of course everything's now online. There you go. Okay, I like that. So that's going to conclude Saturday. And now moving on to Sunday. I'm filming this pretty early in the day. So there's still not much that I can write down. But I think that I'm going to put... What do I want to put? I actually don't know. I might just put like church, my church script. I think I'm going to do some like washi. And then I'll put 
one of these fancy labels for church. Let's actually do that. Up for church. I want to put that I'm going to go live on Patreon today. So I might just end up getting this half box. I'm just going to put that at the end. I think Paul's going to be joining me on the live stream tonight. Um, I think he's going to bring Chipotle. <laughs> so for my last live stream of April, I'm going to take this, but let's do, let's see. I might have space to put food just in case I do end up, let's see. Okay, so I have my church scripts and I think I have budget time ones and my simply those are the ones so that's okay so let me do a church script up here and then for budget time we will use which one should I use I kind of like this purple okay we'll put that and then we'll do our header wow look at her she did not forget her header this time Okay, let's see. So it's going to be this one. And then I'll have just enough space to put my budget time sticker. Well, actually, I wanted to put something else in there. Okay, let's see. Maybe I shouldn't have put that washi strip. Let's fix this. Okay, I feel like that was a little bit crooked than what it needed to be. What if I now let's do the header? Let's do the budget time. Ooh, look, and I have one more of these meal stickers. Perfect. So let's do. I'm almost certain that we're gonna have Chipotle, but I'm just gonna leave it blank for now, just in case. And then I'll put one of these. Let's use, it's not purple, it kinda looks purple. Let's do EA. Perfect, and that's gonna be for my patron live stream. So I think that's gonna be pretty much it for the spread. Let me go ahead and put back my pages so I can give you guys a whole overview of the spread. I wish that you guys could see how many stickers I truly have around me right now because it's a mess. <laughs> so this is how my spread ends up looking. I love all the purple, the silver foil. I've been so obsessed with foiled kits, if you guys have not noticed, but I always mentioned how it looks really naked up here, and I think I've seen a couple of people here lay down flags. So this kit does have a couple of flags, so that's what I'm going to put up up top since this doesn't have deco. So let me actually try to do this. I guess that works. That works. Okay, perfect. So that's pretty much going to be it for this video. I really hope that you guys enjoyed kind of looking through what it is that I did last week. As you guys can see, I'm pretty, pretty busy most days. And I don't know, I like being busy, but I'm also like, oh, I'm so tired. Like maybe I should, you know, cut it down a little bit. But yes, if you guys enjoyed this video, please don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up as well as subscribe to my channel if you guys are not subscribed already. And hopefully I will get to see you guys on my next video. Bye guys.